think the biggest one is misinformation. So you've got so many people who are getting stuck in these diet loops of trying things just obsessively over and over again. So they went on the Atkins diet and then they went on a low fat diet and then they went on a keto diet and they keep going, I can't figure out how to get health. It seems like a mystery to me. And I'd be lying to you guys if I said that I wasn't one of those people. I was constantly trying to figure out like, how could I feel better? I know that inherently something is wrong and I'm not being told what it is. Um, and I feel like I just got to a point where I was like, I need to get to the bottom of what this is. And one, I need to be able to figure this out for myself, but two, then I need to share it with people. Um, and the biggest misconceptions that I'm finding is like, they're more restrictive of a diet you have, um, the, the better results you're gonna get when it's all about sustainability. It's what you do every single day that matters because people will lose the, the 30 pounds in three months and then right I would on. just, yeah, they just put it right back on. And then I come and I see him again. And I'm like, we're just stuck in this loop, guys. And all the while they're like, my knees ache, I'm not sleeping well, I don't feel good, I'm like I'm having digestive issues. And so getting to the bottom of that is what really, really inspired me. Is that part of